the diagram shows a rope bridge that a student makes on an adventure training course. The student has a weight W, which formula gives the tension T in the rope? Okay, so we need to find out a formula that links tension and W. So let's first draw all the forces on the diagram, starting with the weight force. So the weight of the student is going to be downwards, straight downwards. Next, the tension forces, the tension along the ropes. The direction of the tension forces are going to be directed away from the student. Remember tension force, the direction of tension force is always away from the object. In this case, the object is the student. So the tension forces will be directed away from the student on both sides. Now we need to resolve the tension forces into their components into the horizontal and vertical components. So let's do that. For this tension on the left, the two components are going to be T sine theta and T cosine theta. Very similarly, for the tension to the right, you're going to have very similar components, T sine theta and T cosine theta. Okay, now the student is hanging and he's basically in equilibrium. Equilibrium means the forces need to be balanced. So we need to find out the relationship between tension and weight. So I'm going to consider the vertical components. Because, of course, in the horizontal direction, there is no weight. So my equation could be T sine theta plus T sine theta is equal to the weight. Upward forces are equal to the downward forces. Now let's solve this equation. 2T sine theta is equal to W. Rearrange. T is equal to W divided by 2 sine theta. And that's it. That matches option number B. And that's our answer. 